नमस्कार दोस्तों मैं इस वीडियो में प्रेजेंट करने जा रहा हूं एक न्यूमेरिकल प्रॉब्लम जिसको मैंने मैक्रो इकोनॉमिक्स एनालिसिस से चैप्टर थ्योरी ऑफ प्रोड्यूसर बिहेवियर से दिया हूं ये वीडियो एक्सट्रीमली यूजफुल है इग्नो बीए एंड एमए इकोनॉमिक्स ठीक है एंड एमए इग्नो एमए इकोनॉमिक्स का पेपर एनईसी 101 एंड एमए बीए इग्नो बीए इकोनॉमिक्स का पेपर बीई CC101 ठीक है मैक्रो इकोनॉमिक्स ठीक है तो ये क्वेश्चंस है इसका सलूशन हमको प्रेजेंट करना है इस वीडियो के माध्यम से तो सबसे पहले देखते हैं क्वेश्चन क्या कह रहा है व्हाट क्वेश्चन इज टेलिंग अस द प्रोडक्शन फंक्शन फॉर अ फॉर्म इज अ गिवन बाय q 20l 41k 20k स्क्वायर 3k स्क्वायर इट इज द प्रोडक्शन फंक्शन q डिनोटिंग द आउटपुट l एंड k denoting labor and capital respectively and wages and interest rate are given w equal to 4 and r equal to 5 yani wages wages are given to labor and rent are given to capital the price of output is also given equal to 1 rupees and finally we have to calculate equilibrium output so how equilibrium output is calculated it is a very simple first <coughs> Profit function. Pi stand for profit function. Everybody know is differences between total revenue and total cost. That is TR minus TC. First get the value of TR and TC. ठीक है आप ये दोनों TR और TC का value निकाल के दोनों को subtract कर दोगे तो pi आएगा. That is the pi denoting profit. अगर profit maximize होगा तो वही equilibrium output होगा. And equilibrium output is a found at a point where profit is maximum. Okay. Now, how TR is calculated? Very simple. Price into output. Price is a given one rupee. Thank you. The value of Q output is equal to 20 L plus 41 K minus 2 L square minus 3 K square. And if you multiply by 1, we get the same result, 20 L plus 41K minus 2 L square minus 3K square. Now it is a time to uh, calculate TC. TC stands for total cost. And total cost kya hai? Ki the amount is spent on Number of labor and capital respectively, W L plus R K. This is the total cost for this uh, in a cream. Okay. Yeah. W and R wages at rent and L and K are uh, denoting labor and capital respectively. And then what? W and R is the given. Or W equal to four L plus R. Value of R, 5K. Now, so far, we have calculated total revenue and total cost. Now, put and substitute the value of total revenue and total cost. Total uh, revenue is a 20L plus 41K. Minus 2L square minus 3K square. This is the value of total revenue we have calculated. And now minus TC. Minus TC that is the profit cost is a given 4L plus 5K. 4L plus 5K. Now solve this. 20L plus 41K minus 2L square minus 3K square minus 4L minus 5K and we need next task we need to do maximize the profit maximizing profit maximizing profit maximizing of profit 
we need to test two condition first order condition f for c stand for first order condition del pi that is the we are taking the partial derivative of pi with respect to l and k respectively and setting equal to zero del l equal to zero and del pi with respect to k equal to zero and now soc stand for second order condition and second order derivative with respect to l uh, for maximum value less than zero and del pi del k square less than zero for maximum value now check the first order condition first write down the pi profit function profit function is a given 20 l plus 41k minus 2l square minus 3k square minus 4l minus 5k foc first order condition del pi by del l equal to 0 a bit if we take the partial derivative of pi with respect to l we get 20 minus 4 l minus 4 equal to 0 solve if 20 minus 4 16 minus 4 l <coughs> equal to 0 minus 4 l equal to minus 16 l equal to 16 by 4 equal to 4. And now check it second order condition, second order derivative of pi with respect to uh, L less than 0. If we take the second order derivative, obviously we get minus 4, which is the less than 0, and second order condition for maximum value is a satisfied here. And now and what value we got for L? L equilibrium value. Yeah, equilibrium number of labor implied is 4. And now, take the partial derivative with respect to k and set equal to 0. Obviously, 4k, sorry, 41. We are taking the partial derivative of k, pi with respect to k. At the same time, another variable L is held constant. 41 minus 6k minus 5 equal to 0. Solve for k. 36 minus 6k equal to 0. 30, uh, minus 6k equal to minus 36. Minus minus can see k equal to therefore k equal to 36 by 6 equal to 6. Now we got uh, equilibrium number of capital implied is a 6 unit. Now substitute this value in uh, cube in order to get equilibrium output. Okay. cube equal to 20 what value we got for l equal to 4 into 4 plus 41 into 6 minus 2 l square that is a 4 l square and minus 3 k into 6 square 80 plus 6 24 now minus 2 into 16 minus 3 into 36 80 and 24 okay 80 plus 2 46 minus 32 minus 6 3 the adding carry one 3 3 the 9 and 1 10. now 2 4 6 80 6 12 26 140 
12 at 1. Now these two term adding we get 326 and by adding minus 20 at 32 minus 108 we get 140 minus 140 and if we subtract final result 186 is the equilibrium output okay and I hope you find this video is extremely useful uh, in order to calculation of equilibrium output equilibrium the number and number of labor and capital implying form toward the maximum possible profit and if you come first time at my channel please subscribe my channel and share as much as you can and thanks for watching my video till end jai hind